Here on the Red Fox Network, it's your Marist football preseason preview. I'm Jeff Brault alongside the head coach, Jim Parity. Camp opens here in less than a week, coach. It seems like, you know, the, the, the win against Davidson to end last season was, you know, a few months ago. And now it's right back to it. A bunch of players have stayed on campus. The whole squad is here in just a few days. Well, what's this time of year like for you when the season is so close? Well, it's been a really good summer, and it's uh, the anticipation right now. Everybody's done their work, and everything that they did, they want to have the opportunity to show us what they've done. And, and uh, we're looking for some gains out of some people, and, uh, but the anticipation is there, and uh, hopefully they're, they're ready to go. All eyes early on the quarterback position, uh, reps up for grabs. You got four guys, and any of them might be under center for the Bucknell game on September 5th. Ed Oxiger started last season. Anthony Francis took over midway through the year. Mike White, local kid from Cornwall, who I know you guys like, he's starting his sophomore year. Same with Brad Westmark, another kid with a lot of talent. What's going to separate one quarterback from another and decide for you? Who's going to be the signal caller on opening night? Their ability to execute the offense, and that, by that I mean make completions in the pass game. Uh, that's really going to be the thing, uh, as I told them when they left spring ball, uh, when they come back in, uh, it, it'll be about that part of it for them, being able to put the ball on the receivers uh, consistently. And the guy who does that is going to be our starter. Uh, a lot of reps available at the running back position as well with the graduation of featured back Atik Lucas. Who do you see coming out of a, of a crowded running back picture to, to get the bulk of the carries? Well, Clay was the kid who had the dynamic spring, and uh, Marcellus did not practice in the spring. He's coming off an injury. He's fully healed. He's ready to go. Had a great summer up here. Uh, and then Leon Cummings, another guy that uh, had a lot of reps in the spring as we were only with uh, two live running backs uh, during the whole spring. So they get a lot of work. Uh, but both uh, Cummings and Clay had very, very productive springs. Uh, but we got to find somebody to get the ball to 15 to 18 times a game. Um, and so maybe one of those three. A guy who's proven quite a bit on the field on the defensive side of the ball is free safety Zach Adler. Uh, led the PFL in interceptions last year, led the country in interceptions last year. Right. Having him back for a fifth year, having that safety valve presence at the free safety position, what does that do for the defense? I, I think it puts Coach Rumsey at ease, I'll tell you that right now. Not only a playmaker, with once the uh, ball is snapped, but pre-snap stuff, getting us to the right coverage, getting us in the right rotation, uh, and identifying formations. So that part really puts Coach Rumsey at ease in knowing that he's going to get the right call made once he puts in a couple of different variables going into the, uh, the certain plays. He said, Coach Jim Parity, I'm Jeff Brault. That's your Marist football preseason preview here on the Red Fox Network.